My dear respect, brothers and sisters, the type of punishment that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala punishes the people, and Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala punishes not for the sake, not because Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is an, uh, is a, is a, is an evil divine, but Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala at the end of the day, He punishes us so, he could, so we could come back to Him. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala wants us to come back to Him, and there are different forms based on, based on an individual that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala punishes people differently based on their characteristics and who, who they are. There are several types of punishment that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala punishes people. For instance, many people when they hear the word punishment, they think, you know, you know, thunder or earthquake or, or Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala might take away his rizq, his, his, his provision or, or some, somebody from his family might die or something along those lines. But that my dear respect brothers and sisters, this, these types of punishments, believe it or not, are later. They come later. You know, they're not the early type of punishment. And this is this is this is the type the, 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 this type of worldly punishment comes for people when they when they, they come at a later stage, they come at a, at a later stage for those who who could only sense them, who only could sense worldly things. But many people who are who are closer to Allah Subhanahu wa Taala yet Allah Subhanahu wa Taala punish them. They have different type of punishment. For instance, Allah Subhanahu wa Taala would make you uh, lose tasting the beauty of your ibadat you, you, you start having less khushu'ah you start doing less righteous things you start not focusing on your prayer you start doing less types of worshipping and etc so this is this is the type of punishment Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala initially give many people in which that and yeah, many people are like oh how come I'm not I, I don't cry when when uh, when I read the Quran how come I'm not having khushu'ah how come how come I, you know, it's difficult for me to do, to, to do qiyam al layl how come it's difficult for me to to wake up for fajr how come it's it's you know I'm having a rough time trying to do good deeds well you need to check there is something that you are doing, my dear respected brother and sister, that you are currently doing, and yet you are you're, you're overlooking. If someone ignores these types of, of punishments, these kind of spiritual punishment, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala would move them to the next stage of the real worldly punishment because they did not sense, they did not sense all these all these warning signs, all these th hints that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala have given us, you know. And the only thing that they would sense is what? Worldly types of punishment.